Okay, guys, you are done this day. I've never felt like this in my entire life. Everywhere I've been, I'm feeling cold. Oh my god, I've been on medication, but it's not doing anything to the guys. Hey guys! Your girl here is not. I don't even know you can hear me. If you can hear me, guys. I've lost my voice. I've been coughing and coughing and coughing in non-stop. <coughs> I feel the worst thing is that if I do cough, like I get a very severe pain on the on the chest area. So it's really really tough. But thank God I'm here at the hospital and um, I've already done some tests in the lab. So. I'm waiting for the results and uh, see what is the problem with me. They have done a few tests and uh, I'm hoping that it's not something serious and let Equatio Takama ni malaria or maybe I don't know but I'm really really scared because I hate hospitals. Me not curious and any that person who prefers I don't know what even my lips are so they are really really dry. I haven't eaten any, anything since yesterday. I tried to eat and every time I start eating I do cough, 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 cough and uh, I end up like every time I try to eat I cough a lot and uh, I end up not even feeling to eat anymore. And my appetite is so low. So, 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 no. so I'm trying so much to force myself to take fruits because you guys know if you take fruits they at least help when it comes to opening up, to opening you up for you to be able to, to regain your appetite and everything. So I'm here at the hospital, it's district, it's a referral hospital, so let me just wait and it's always Full, this place but the good thing is that their treatment it's one of the best it's one of a kind you know see come up private and this is your food private size I do my NHIF card I don't know it got expired or something so I have to treat myself with cash 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 so let me wait over here I'm waiting for the lab results and see what going to be I'm trying to smile and uh, because I love you guys to accuracy subscribe imagine I'm sick and uh, I'm doing a vlog for you guys <laughs> it's because since the year started I've not that okay I did a vlog and uh, I've not been able to to post it because with Jan on yesterday I didn't even come out of the bed so yeah chat mumbi sa sa ina shida God is just amazing I came here and through a friend of mine I go I got referred to a, a guy who is um, anafanya in the theater and he has been really really helping me considering what we went so he has helped me a lot and uh, I've been able to see the doctor go to the lab and I'm so thankful juninga semani for the line 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 it will it will it will have taken me like I don't know four hours or five hours, <laughs> but Mungu ala kujanga tu in his own way. God comes in a way that you never imagined or you never expected. So let's see what the results will say. By the way, guys, don't mind my hair. Every time I try to unplate it, something just comes up. And especially headache. Okay. You, I know definitely you can't remove your hair like when you're having a headache. You need to take any disturbance on that hair. 
and ever since this year started, I started feeling unwell from the first first date, like date one. I, had, I went for a Kesha and when I came in the morning, I just started feeling weird and from there until now, today is on date seven. I'm hoping things will get better so that and is a tonale at least nyende ni shuke ni kai vizuri ama aje guys and you need to but it is is what it is man sometimes you just have to go with the situation there is no way you can force things unaenda tuna venye vitu ziko feeling fine the last time i was doing a vlog it is in this, this vlog where i was in the hospital i told you guys it was on date seven but it was not on seventh it was on 10th of tuesday this week and today is uh, on 13th which is on friday so i haven't been able to continue to finish this vlog ever since i started it because uh, well, things have been really, really tough, like tough, 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 tough. But I finally got the results that same day, and uh, I was diagnosed to be having malaria. My chest, as I told you guys, every time I cough, I feel so pain. And uh, also, they realized that my sugar levels were low. So when it comes to sugar levels, it's something that um, affected me when I was in campus. I think it was in my first year. And then I used to have like sometimes the sugar levels were high up, sometimes the sugar levels dropped. But it was able to, uh, like the doctors were able to control it and um, I never had an issue with it until now. But thank God I was given some medication and I was told to make sure that I have I eat doesn't matter whether I have appetite or not, I just have to eat so that I can be able to regulate those sugar levels. And they gave me medication and on on Wednesday things were so so bad. I couldn't get out of bed. I couldn't do anything. Uh, it was only my friend who came. She was the one who did everything in my house. The, yesterday also I was still feeling a bit weak but uh, medication have been helping me. I was even thinking of going back to the hospital, but thank God the medication worked and I am feeling fine, rich. Even though I'm still not that strong, I don't feel like eating that much, but at least I can eat, at, at least I can move, at least I can do something, and it, I feel great, by the way. It scares me so much that I'm starting a year with sickness and everything, but beauty in your life guys it's life so this is my first first video of this year i did a video i haven't like gotten time to post it i haven't had i, have, I haven't had time like to post it and everything so i'm hoping i'll gain i'll regain my strength back i'll regain my courage back and i'll be back on the track the way i had planned for this year to be i know Life is full of challenges, you know, getting sick, it's part of them, you know, so it's all about, it's all about rising up again and uh, conquering everything that wants to put you down. So, let me continue with the medication and right, right now the thing that, the thing that I'm still having an issue with is the chest whereby if I cough, I still feel pain, but it's not as much as the way it was before, which is good practice. My hair, guys, I have been saying, don't mind it. Probably next week, if I feel okay completely, I'm gonna do something with it because I feel, I can't even go outside there. <laughs> I felt so bad for myself, but guys, 
you understand so guys that's it for me continue wishing me quick recovery guys because i still need it i'm struggling to smile and uh, i am avoiding to cough because if i cough you will run away so thank you so much guys for watching today's video hope you have enjoyed it remember to subscribe until next time bye bye god bless and happy new year happy 2023